the first uh, jazz guitar that I heard was Charlie Christian on a record with Benny Goodman. Uh, it was a Benny Goodman sextet, and it was Charlie Christian. And uh, I never got to see him play. He uh, he died really young, but that was that was a big influence on my life. Um, it so it seems that first of all, I for me learning about jazz is a is a lifetime process. I mean, I still I'm sure you do the same thing. I still work on it every day. I listen to music all the time. Um, I listen to all kinds of music, uh, but I think that the process it, in order to learn it like if if I were to learn Japanese which would be incredibly difficult for me I would probably have to live in Japan for a while and really practice and hear it all the time uh, and that's what it was like for me learning jazz even though I lived in America um, I had to listen a lot and uh, and I'm sure you have too so. yes uh, being in New York is uh gives me it's a lots, help. Lots, lots, lots of a chance to yeah. listen to great players, yeah. jazz, jazz dialect, what you call it. Right, the jazz, the, yeah. Jazz language, language, yeah. language of jazz. Yeah, yeah, it does take a lot, just, and also if I were to learn um, uh, rock and roll, I guess I would have to have, to have to yeah, right. change my hair <laughs> and uh, listen to a lot of rock and roll for a while. So for me, uh, as I said a little earlier, this has been a, Kind of a lifelong process, and and I still work it, uh, work at it every day, and uh, uh, it's it's great for me in so many ways because I travel a lot, and I find people all over the world in Japan, in Europe, in South America who play who play jazz music, and it's sort, of, and I can play music with people that I can't even talk Speak to. Can, the yeah, language, can, right. right? So the language isn't any problem. Uh, also, it keeps changing. Your playing keeps changing with you. Don't you find that? I think so. Yeah. Uh, Is it? I'm, somehow, I hope so. Too. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure your experience of being in New York has changed your playing a lot. Right? I think so. Yeah. It's, it's, so it's kind of a uh, it's kind of a record of your of your personal growth. I think you know, as well as a musical thing. It's a personal thing. It's like. Uh, it's similar to if, if you have a child and you want to see how the child grows and you draw a line at the top of the kid's head on the, <laughs> oh, no. on the wall, right? And then in two years he's up and then he's further up. Um, so it, it's a combination of fun and uh, seriousness and lots of listening, I think. It, so it's, it's work, but it's the kind of work that, uh, that's, that's really enjoyable and it, and it goes on forever.